Sabri Thompson, senior guard for the Northwestern State Demon basketball team, and today a national figure with the announcement of the All-State Good Works team presented by the uh, National Association of Basketball Coaches recognizing five seniors from around Division I basketball for elite community service. Sabri, what uh, is your reaction to this honor? Uh, I was definitely surprised because I've, I know that it, only five um, Division One players in the nation can get this honor, so it was definitely I was very shocked, and then um, the way Coach Mike presented it was like in no way other better than that because he got emotional and then just giving me that shout out in front of um, the whole Demon family was definitely remarkable and a great feeling, and I'm still in shock, but it feels good to get that honor. At what point when he was talking to you and the team did you realize this is about me? Um, he, um, told, he told uh, the guys that uh, guys that do well don't really get recognized. And he um, actually said my name, but I had no idea he was about to say, well, you're getting recognized now for um, getting that honor. So he kind of like, I like the way he did it, but um, yeah, it was definitely good. And I was just like, wow, but yeah, definitely good. And when he got emotional, I start, I was about to get emotional, but I had to hold it in and try to just smile it off. <laughs> All right, now that you've had an hour or so to reflect on it, what does this mean to you? Uh, this means a lot, definitely for um, the Demon family, uh, NSU as a whole, um, my family, I know they're very proud of me and myself. Um, and actually my teammates because a lot of those guys like um after seeing it they have been tweeting me talking about i'm their role models and i know that like guys look up to me but just seeing that is just definitely positive and maybe i can motivate some other guys to um i know that some of the guys actually said i do motivate them to like go to class get good grades so that's definitely a good feeling that i can reach people in a different way not just athletically when did this start for you i mean i know when you got here, you pretty much dived into the community service activities that were going on. Mm -hmm. When did this commitment start for you? I did a little bit of community service um, back home. Um, my high school coach, we did we did a few things, not much like we do here, but um, it, just, I, it just came natural to me and just felt good to do, um, just giving back to the community. And my favorite thing that's community service is when we go back to talk to you know, like inner city kids in Natchitoches area because that's where I come from. And I know where they're, I know where they're at, and I know like the situation that they're in, and I just want to like tell them that is nothing is impossible if you just you know stay focused, stay out of the streets, you know, and you can get anywhere in life if you just stay focused and work hard. Of all of the experiences you've had, and this covers back home in New Jersey and Delaware, and it covers uh, China, uh, it covers certainly all around this area. Are there ones that really stick out to you? I like experiences. Yeah. Um, the China experience definitely sticks out because it's a humbling experience. Um, we in America, we don't understand how good we really have it until you go over there and see like they definitely have a lot of advanced uh, cities. But if you go to some of those places, you just see like, wow, like we're very advanced and we have it better than a lot of people. And it's humbling and we need to like appreciate what we have while we have it. And now that you have been recognized this way, one cool thing is you get to go to the final four. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but how else is this going to impact you? I think this will impact me because um, this is a national award and you never know what type of connections I might make um, being out there in the Final Four. I'm definitely going to try to network myself um, in the business world. That would be my major. Um, networking is very important. You never know the type of people I might meet. Um, athletically, it might help me as well um, get my name out there. But um, I just I just think that it's not even about me. I just, like, I just want to thank everybody that helps me out, um, like people help me out that I don't even know about and I just, like behind the scenes, like you guys, I just appreciate all that y'all do for me and I'm glad that I can represent the school in a good way. Okay, for uh, uh, your future, what are your plans? For the future, um, definitely want to play pro, like that's definitely always my dream, but um, you know, I'll just try to get a job in my career field, if that if basketball doesn't work out for me, you know, just um, just try to be successful in whatever I do, maybe open my own business. Um, come up with some innovative things, you know, just just work hard and whatever I'm doing, I know I'm going to work hard at it. All right. And what, uh, if any way, does this change what you tell young people as you go forward with your community service endeavors? I think it um, it, it helps it even more. I have um, like, I guess it gave me a better credential for them to uh, see like, oh, yeah, he's he's really for real about this. He's not just saying it because they'll actually see like that. If you work hard to benefit, you will reap the benefits if you do well. And, and you see the positive effects on it. All right, what's better, game-winning three-pointer or this honor? Game-winning three-pointer, but uh, both, both of them really, but uh, definitely um, I think at the end, we got to finish this season strong, try to, uh, I'm finishing it well academically, but I definitely want to finish it well on the court as well, and I feel like we can do it 
with the guys that we have, especially uh, guys coming back from injuries. Yeah, I just I just want to finish this year strong, and it seems like everything is just coming positively now at the end of the year. So I just just thank God for everything.